Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Gloria and today I thought that I would start a new series on my channel. So I want to start doing um, outfits of the week videos. I know like 2020, literally everybody was sitting in their PJs at home all day long and I'm, I'm no different. Um, I literally did that the whole 2020 as well and looks like for most of 2021, I probably will be working from home as well. So I kind of just, I've gotten a little fed up with wearing um, my PJs and sweats all day long. So I thought that instead of letting my clothing get so dusty and just sit in the wardrobe without getting any use, I thought that I would start a new series for you guys and do outfits of the week, both to inspire you what to wear every single day, as well as get me to get out of my sweats and get use out of my own clothing that is sitting in my wardrobe. Because literally I know most of us are in the same situation, so let's let's make 2021 a little bit more fun and a little bit better. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed these series. I am going to make a playlist, kind of just dedicating these outfits of the week, outfit and spo style videos to like one playlist. So you could just always go back for some inspiration later on. Without further ado, Let's get into today's outfit. Okay, you guys, so this is the outfit for today. These shoes are from Zara. I got these three years ago. I love these. Honestly, they've lasted so well. I was not expecting like a pair of, I think, $60 shoes to last me this long. And I wear them really like pretty often. So I know they don't have these in stock anymore, these shoes. So I'll make sure to link something similar down below in addition to obviously everything I mentioned in this video. But yeah, um, I love these shoes. They actually have pretty good traction. Um, and my pants are from Levi's. These are the rib cage straight leg jeans. They're honestly also one of my favorite pair of jeans that I own. They're just super high waisted. Um, they're really flattering and not to mention they're super comfortable. Um, the one downside with these I would say is they actually um, did stretch out quite a bit on me, which was pretty surprising. I wasn't expecting that. So I would definitely say if you're getting it sized down. And for my turtleneck, this is a beautiful 100% cashmere turtleneck from Aritzia. I got this one last year as well, so I don't know if it's still in stock, but oh my God, I love this turtleneck. It is actually like the most comfortable thing I have ever worn when it comes to like my sweaters. Um, this is just really premium, really beautiful, very well made. I've actually had this one, like I said, for about a year and I actually have two of it. I have it in obviously this like lavender color I also have it in like a gray, but yeah, both of them are just super good quality. They've lasted me super well and they're pretty good. I don't have any issue with them. And then obviously it's got this like super high neck that's just really cozy and comfortable for the Canadian winter. A little tip for you guys, if you want your turtlenecks to look a little bit more sleek, I would definitely say tuck them inwards, like roll them inwards instead of outwards. And you kind of get less lines like that and it looks way more chic. So yeah, this is the look for today. And that's her look for today and every single day. <laughs> yeah, just really comfortable um, and cozy. Much comfort. Are we just chilling here? Are we? Looks like we might be for a while at least. Hi guys, how are you? So today is Wednesday and this is the look for today. That's Inara's toy. Um, again, I'm wearing the same shoes as yesterday. Um, these are by Zara. Like I said, I'll try to link something similar. I literally wear these all the time. I've had them for almost three years now and they're super good. And my pants, these are from Aritzia. I got these, I think in like spring. I would say they're like pretty similar to like classic cargo pants, nothing too special about them. But yeah, um, these are just extremely comfortable. I love wearing these. And yeah, they're like super stretchy and I think it's just like really good for like casual um, days like this. Okay, and the turtleneck, this is from, I believe Uniqlo. It's like one of their fine, um, fine knit merino wool turtlenecks. This is super comfortable. It's just like not only a really good layering piece, but I think this is actually pretty good on its own. I think Uniqlo has really good basics pieces. If you're looking for something simple, um, they're just like my go-to. And again, like I showed you guys yesterday, I like to tuck in um, the neck inwards instead of outwards. So it's got like less lines and it's more sleek. That's my dog. <laughs> Why are you so complainy? So I've done that with this one. Um, I also have this turtleneck in black. Like I said, yeah, it's just like a really good, nice basic piece to have. So the plan for today is I need to go to Ikea. So you guys, 
um, probably see these if you follow me on Instagram, these cabinets. These are the Ivar cabinets by Ikea. So these cabinets, um, these are like the smaller um, size that they have and we didn't realize that when we got it. We got these I think about six months ago. I haven't been a big fan of them honestly just because they are too small for what we need them to be. So I've just seen that they are in stock, the bigger size of these. So yeah, we're gonna go hopefully exchange for the bigger size and yeah. Hopefully can get a little bit more space. These are super useful, but yeah, they're just they're just a little too small. Good afternoon, you guys. Good afternoon. Today is Thursday. It's the first week everyone is back in their business, and I can't even remember the day of the week. <laughs> anyway, this is what I'm wearing today. I've been in a really crappy mood, I'm not gonna lie. Just not in the best mood, so I thought I'd put myself in a really cozy outfit. I am gonna take my shoes off in a second. I just put it on to show you guys because the plan today is I need to actually go out to do some returns. I also really wanna buy a planner from possibly Indigo or Chapters. We'll see what's on the way. Yeah, I really wanna buy one of those like really nice like planners to kind of help me um, visualize everything for the year that's coming. I have a lot of goals, I have a lot of plans. I'll talk about it as we go, but I just, I have some trouble kind of organizing everything. So I've never been like a planner kind of person. I've always just like used my notes app on my computer or like Google Calendar, Google Docs, whatever tool I had on my computer. I've never really had like a full on agenda. So I want to see um, if that'll help me. I just kind of want to try it out. I also have like a lot of like good pens and pencils and stuff left over from when I um, was an engineering student. So yeah, I thought, you know, maybe I could bring some artsiness <laughs> into planning and maybe that'll kind of help me. So yeah, I don't know. I'll show you guys if I get anything, of course. But yeah, as I was saying, um, this is the outfit. These are my Dr. Martin's Jaden, I think two boots they're called. These are, they're honestly okay. They're not my favorite pair of boots I've owned. Um, they're quite edgy, which I like. The comfort level with these guys I would say is actually okay. They're not as bad as I had heard Dr. Martin's um, boots being. I'm pretty okay with them, the quality I'm not so happy with. These are actually the vegan ones. I didn't get them because I wanted the vegan boots. I actually just like the fact that this was like all black. The original um, Dr. Martens, those guys are, um, they have like the yellow stitching. But yeah, I would say I don't like the quality as much. I actually have Zara boots that are nicer. <laughs> um, the ones that I've shown you guys in the past two days. Actually, I think the quality on those guys is way better and those are pleather. And my sweater dress, this is from Zara. It's actually this season, so it should still be in stock, hopefully. I love this. I talked about it in my Zara haul. If you guys haven't watched it, I'll link it somewhere on the um, screen right now. I love this dress. This is literally the best sweater dress I have ever owned. It's super comfortable. It's not see-through at all. It's just, yeah, it's really comfortable, like I said. It's just, I think, really flattering and it's just like such a staple piece to have for fall and winter and it's not really something trendy so you can pretty much wear it as long as um, it lasts which I actually would make a guess that it should actually last pretty well. The quality is pretty nice on it. But yeah, like you guys can see, it's got like a fine knit material to it. This is also what the neck looks like. It's not super tight. It's pretty comfortable, I would say. Just very flattering and very simple. Ooh, I'm gonna put on some earrings. So I'm gonna wear these um, pearl hoop earrings. These are by a brand called DVNE on Etsy. I think it's like um, Divine is their brand. It's a Canadian brand. They sell really high quality gold plated jewelry over I believe silver. So if you're interested, definitely check them out on Etsy. I will leave a link to them down below. Yeah, I've been really happy with them. I think they're pretty cool. If you're looking for some really simple, minimal jewelry pieces, Check them out. Hi guys, so today is Friday um, and this is the look for today. Um, I'm actually not going anywhere today. I'm gonna be home probably all day long. So hence the comfortable little slippers. But I thought that I would get myself into a nice cozy outfit. It's actually a little bit chilly outside, but it's really sunny, which is kind of making the house really hot right now. So I might just take off this cardigan later if I get a little too hot. So yeah, let's let's jump into 
the details of today's outfit. So these guys are from Sorel. I got these actually I think like two years ago I want to say for Christmas. So they're quite old but I will try to link them down below. I think they still do them. I'm pretty sure they do. They're similar to the Ugg ones but I'm pretty sure they're more affordable than the Ugg ones. And yeah, they're really comfortable. They're really cozy. Very soft, they've got like the shearling inside as well. And for the jeans, these are the same things I was wearing the other day. These are the Levi's ribcage jeans. I've already told you guys how much I love these jeans, so no need to go on about that. And the cardigan, obviously the main um, part of this outfit. This is from Cezanne. This is their um, Gaspard cardigan, I believe it's what it's called. Sorry if I'm butchering the name, I don't know how to speak French. Um, but yeah, this is a beautiful cardigan. Um, it's really warm, it's really soft, but the one downside with it um, for me is it is a tad bit itchy. So I do always have to layer um, a long sleeve underneath. And today I thought I'd pair it with like this really delicate thin turtleneck. Um, this is from Uniqlo. Um, it is really see-through. It is part of their heat tech collection. It's not supposed to be like something you wear on its own. It's a layering piece and it's really soft. It's really comfortable. It's not the same thing as I was wearing the other day. Um, I showed you guys like a white one as well. That was from Uniqlo. That one is supposed to be worn mostly on its own, but this guy, um, this is a layering piece. Like I said, it's from their Heat Tech range. Very see-through, but really good layering piece. Very soft. It's like really cozy. It just feels really nice on the body. So today's actually my first time that I'm pairing like a turtleneck underneath this cardigan usually I like to wear like like a really low cut um, t-shirt or something like that just because I like the look of the cardigan on its own but I'm, I'm kind of liking it I think it's like a different look than I usually do so yeah I think this would be like a really nice Saturday Sunday look as well just like if you're chilling at home with family and yeah I didn't put on any of my jewelry I don't generally put on my jewelry when I'm at home um, unless I'm actually planning to go somewhere just because I like to play with my dog and she kind of licks my face and I'm worried accidentally she might grab something. So yeah, no jewelry for the days at home. But yeah, this is the total look. I did do my hair today. Um, I did these like very um, loose waves with my air wrap. If you haven't seen my air wrap tutorial, I'll link it above. This is a little bit different than the one I showed you guys in the tutorial. This is just like very loose waves. Hi guys, so today is Saturday and this is the look for today. Hi Inara. So again, I'm wearing the same Zara boots that I'm sure you guys are tired of hearing about at this point. And my pants, these are from Everlane. These are their like classic wide leg fit pants. I love these, they're super comfortable. Actually, I just washed mine so it's a little bit tight um, on my waist, but they're super comfortable. I think they're just so fun and they have so many different colors. I think they're also just really flattering and in general, I think Everlane just like um, makes really good quality clothing. So if you've never tried them out, I definitely recommend it. Um, this is the same Uniqlo turtleneck that I showed you guys the other day in white or like a creamish color. This is the black one. Again, this is just like a really comfortable um, sweater. It's got merino wool in it. I I think it's just like not only a, a really good layering piece but it's just like super comfortable it's just like a good basic to have because you can literally make so many different looks with it and it's just super comfortable and Uniqlo is literally my favorite place to go for basics because honestly they're really affordable and they have so many good quality pieces that last you a really long time in your basics collection and my hair is from yesterday I curled it um, I did judge up the waves a little bit I just added a few more that had gone a little limp from yesterday but yeah this is the total look today. So the plan for today is we are going grocery shopping and yes, I did dress up to go grocery shopping. We need milk um, and a few other things. So we're gonna go grocery shopping. And then after that, I need to edit this video and make it ready to go up on Sunday for you guys. So that completes this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, I'm going to make a playlist and upload all the future um, videos in this series in that playlist. So if you're interested, you can check them out for outfit inspos. And yeah, I hope that these videos kind of give you guys an idea of what to wear, even if you're working from home. I think it's just fun to dress up, even if it's something simple. So yeah, if you recreate any of these looks, make sure to tag me on Instagram. I would love to see you guys recreate them. And thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will see you in my next one. Bye.